what's in store for Maui following the wildfires. Well, Secretary Buttigieg was here to talk about transportation infrastructure and what can be done uh, for Maui. Um, of course, the Honolulu-Pi'ilani uh, Highway Bypass is underway, and um, that's been a successful project. Uh, he's also, you know, just understanding what how he might be able to help in Lahaina Town in terms of the recovery. I don't want to um, announce anything for him, but he's a very responsive guy and wants to help the state of Hawaii and um, the island of Maui and especially uh, West Maui. So um, it was a good uh, trip. Um, I got an update from the Army Corps and I was really happy to know that they feel that they are on track with clearing all of the individual residential properties on time uh, to allow people to move uh, back uh, when they feel comfortable and to start to rebuild. And are you happy with the progress made to date six months after the wildfires? I know you've been pushing for a lot of legislation to help the victims. Well, I think, you know, I, I, I take away two positives and one negative. Um, first, I think it's really great that the Army Corps is going to finish um, clearing those properties um, within the 12-month deadline that they had originally set. Uh, second, you know, the school is, uh, is going to be completed and will be open on April 1st, which is really an incredible time frame to rebuild an entire uh, elementary school. But I think the bad news is that we just simply haven't built enough um, temporary housing, modular housing uh, for the folks that are uh, currently in hotels and Airbnbs. And so that's where um, my urgency is to keep the federal support, but um, local, state, uh, federal government, we really got to focus on building now.